Thank you so much. And thank you for giving me this possibility to participate in this excellent conference. I thank um, Madame Azoulay and Madame Giannini for doing this um, very good initiative as well as UNESCO and of course the government of the United Kingdom. Um, our children have a right to the best education possible. And that is why in the last weeks and months here in Malta, as elsewhere, we have done our utmost to reopen all schools and to provide the best education, which is in-class education. And I think this is something which um, provides uh, proof of how much we believe in education and the fact that education is in itself um, a guarantee of a better tomorrow and a better future. We believe that emphasis must be made on open-ended educational pathways, which, which move away from a one-size-fits-all system to a more inclusive and equitable program. And therefore, this would enable learning to be reimagined. Re Reimagining teaching and learning must take into account the following points. First, the use of evidence-based approaches. Secondly, embedding climate and environmental themes. Thirdly, vocational training. Fourthly, strengthening the link between education at all levels and industry. Fifth, making use of community resources. Sixth, we need to prepare future generations to become responsible agents of a more just, sustainable and peaceful world. Seventh, using digital tools. And lastly, we believe that the 2020 GEM declaration can serve as a very good guide to help us achieve this end. Therefore, Malta um, favors approaches which facilitate further exchange among member states. Thank you so much.